Hey, I'm going to give you guys four quick tips that I picked up changing out shocks on my 1999 F250 Super Duty. Uh, these are kind of tricks that I didn't quite see explained very well in the videos that I watched. Number one, my wheel froze to, my aluminum wheel froze to the hub and I had to work like a beast to get this thing off. And so I did see a tip where a guy would uh, jack up this, this um, tire and then he would uh, beat on it with a, with a big old mallet or hammer. I did a little variation of that because I did hear of some reports of, or see some reports of tires being damaged. So when you do elevate the wheel and you um, start hitting on it, then uh, use a block or something like that to spread out the load so you don't damage the tire in the process. So that's number one. Number two, on the shocks um, themselves, I did spend a little bit of time trying to figure out which way is the right side up. There's some information that says that the reservoir should be on the bottom versus reservoir should be on the top or it doesn't matter. Bottom line on these 4600 Bilstein shocks, you can't mount them upside down. The fittings are only, um, only work one way, so don't sweat the small stuff. So that's number two. Um, number three, um, on, the, on the, uh, the shocks, I had a real hard time getting them compressed to just the right height on the the back side on the on the back and these shocks do come with these uh bands that do compress do compress the the shocks unfortunately the, the they're not exactly the right length it to have the as far as the distance between the, the mounting bolts on the top and the bottom so after working about 10 15 minutes trying to get them just right uh, i in fact just used my own strap and i compressed it to just the right length uh to for for them to fit right onto that right onto that um the, the the mounting bolt up on top at that point once i got it started then i just used a larger socket and i just beat that uh beat that uh, uh mount right on there so that's number three number four uh the the install or the uh the mounting on the front struts is a little bit tricky the there is a lock washer on the nut side that looks kind of like this uh, and what you need to do is when you loosen up the nut on that front end then you actually have to t turn the bolt not the nut because if you turn the nut you're going to turn this lock washer and you're going to break it like i did so that was a lesson learned so make sure that when you loosen it up on the front on the bottom mounting um, on the front Make sure that you, again, turn the bolt, not the nut, or you're going to break that sucker. So that's all I got for you. Um, these, again, are Bilstein 4600 shocks on an F250 Super Duty 1999 7.3 diesel. So um, good luck with your project.